Hello everyone, I am Lord Trig and today we're gonna create the spider room. <coughs> yes, we're gonna create the spider room, so let's get started by taking some pictures from the game. I mean screenshots, and anyway, I can't do that because the door is locked. But somehow I made this, this is the sketch, let's go. Okay guys, now we're gonna be creating, let's cut the sketch out of this paper. Masterpiece. Okay, step number two, let's create this base. Alright, step number two, let's take some clay. As you see, I got a lot of waste clay, so let's take this and this and maybe this and uh, oh, this as well. Alright, step number three, we're gonna unpacking the clay. Let's get started. Alright, now we're gonna mix it and we're gonna place it into the conditioning machine. So let's place everything. Let's set up this thing for the level one. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to make the magic. Okay, after two hours of conditioning, we got something like this. Okay, two minutes. Okay, now we're gonna see if the color is matching the sketch. Great. Okay, so we're gonna place the sketch, cut it to the size, remove the sketch please. Now we're gonna make the texture of the floor. Beautiful. And we need to cut it just a little bit because right here will be the stairs, okay? So we're gonna cut. Okay, let's make the walls. So we're gonna take the clay because we don't have time to make the clay. Today, we're gonna be opening this pack of clay using only this. This is hard. Ta -da! Okay, we need to make the layer of this clay. So we're gonna just gently ask her if she wants to be a liar. Excuse me? Can you be a layer of clay? It works. So now we are gonna just cut the shapes to make the walls. Okay, now we are gonna place every piece on the bacon tray. We are gonna stick all the pieces to the baking tray. So they will be flat. And we are gonna trim them just a little bit. Okay, now we're gonna make this thing. I think this is just a piece of the wood, so let's make some texture of the wood on it. And on the other side as well. And let's place it somewhere here on the baking tray. Okay guys, what about we're gonna make something more interesting? No, no, there is no time for spider right now. Let's make the home of the spider. Okay, so let's place this piece of clay into onto this sketch and we're gonna cut the shapes out of it, please. Okay, what about we're gonna make the entrance on it? Okay, now we're gonna remove the clay. Okay, it kinda worked. I'm kinda surprised. What about we're gonna make some details on it? And now we're gonna add some parts for the entrance. It's looking pretty nice, so we're gonna move on. No, 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 no to the spider. Right now we're gonna make this. Now I see this button over here. So let's cut thin piece of a clay from this clay. This will be the cable. And we're gonna place it onto the wall next to the house of the spider. And now we're gonna place the button. I'm not sure what it do. Does it close the gate for the house of the spider? I don't know, let me know in the comments. Time for the table, this one. So we need a brown color clay for this. So what about we gonna take this 
and as you see I have a few new colors because yesterday I buy some new colors so now I don't have mixed that much because I have every color of Vimosoft. So let's unpack this clay and we gonna do it with ASMR because ASMR is pretty popular lately. I need just a piece of it. Give me, please. You go in here. You need to. Okay, Lord Zerik. Please cut the table out of me. You have my permission. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, my face. Time for the details on the table. Details are important. Okay. Time to make the legs for the table and the last one come on get out of let's place the table on the baking tray yes we need that and the legs because table without the legs is not table what else do i have to do barrels Let's just make the barrels from this clay, so we're gonna pick all the remainings, maybe we're gonna add some more clay to it, and we're gonna roll it in the hands like this. <coughs> Alright, now we're gonna just cut it into three little barrels. We're gonna shape it so it will look more like a barrel. And we're gonna make some wood details on them. And while I'm making this, let me know in the comments what do you think are in those barrels? Pickles or kids? Or maybe pickled kids? Barrels are ready, now we're gonna make the metal parts. So we just gonna get it into strips. Okay, now we're gonna apply these metal rings onto the barrels. This should be very hard. Okay, barrels are made. Now we're gonna make the lids. Let's make some details on them. And maybe even some more details. And now we're gonna add them to the barrels. Yes! This is so lovely barrel. Leave a like for this. Leave a like, I'm just a tiny barrel. Okay, we're gonna place them on the bacon tray. Okay guys, now what about no no no? What about this shelf in the left corner of this table? Okay, so I got a little piece of the clay and we're gonna just Now we're just gonna cut the doors for the self. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna place the little handle onto the door. Nice! And what about the details? Details are important mm -hmm, because this shelf is made of the wood. And tiny details on the door. You sit here and don't move, please. Now, guys, I think we're gonna make. We're gonna make the plate. So we already have some clay for this, so we're just gonna take this. We're gonna cut the plate out of this. We're gonna place some meat on this. We're gonna mix those two colors together. And we're gonna place it on our stick. And the last element, a tiny bow inside. You know what? No. This doesn't look realistic. We need to flat it a little bit with this. Okay, it doesn't work out, so I made a new one. This one is pretty big, but whatever. And we're gonna place it on the big tree. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, what now? We got barrels, we got table, we got the house of the spider, we got stick. Uh, I think right now we gonna do spider. No, no, the spider. We need to make the bullets for the gun and the gun. 
So let's place the tiny bullets on the tiny table where it is. And now we're gonna make the gun. Okay guys, I think now is the time for the spider. Let's make the body first, he will be pretty big. Let's add the head to the body, tiny front legs. Now we're gonna cut the tiny little red eyes. We're gonna try to make the tiny, tiny, tiny little balls out of it. And we're gonna try to place it on the head of the spider, but this is very hard. Whoa, we made this. Let's place the spider somewhere here. Okay, now we're gonna try to make the very, very, very thin legs of the spider. So we just gonna roll this piece of the clay until it will be very, 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 very thin. I think that's it. So we're gonna cut one from this side, one from this side, and we're gonna just roll it one more time. And again, one from this side, one from this side. And again, one from this, one from this, and the last pair of legs. Okay guys, now we're gonna try to attach those legs to the spider. Guys, this is so tiny and I almost don't see anything. Okay, time for the another leg. We're gonna bend it a little bit. And also from the other side. And also at the bottom. Ah! Okay, it's looking good. And the big one from this side. And the last one. Guys, we're gonna place this little piece of the clay underneath him. Yeah, I think now he's looking much better. Okay, so let's make those doors now. And we're gonna put them over here. This is the wall that we're gonna place all around those stairs. All right, the attic is pretty much done. Now we're gonna make something that I promised you in the last video, or maybe in the last two videos. The granny, mom, Slenderina. I am correct? No, I'm not correct. This is the mom of Slenderina. I don't remember her name, but we're gonna make this room because I forgot to add it in the first floor video of Granny House. It should be behind this bookshelf. So let's cut the base. And some of the walls. Now we're gonna make the paintings on the wall in this room. So let's mix some of the clay. This looks more like the abstract art, but whatever, we're not gonna go too much into the details on those paintings. We're gonna save some time and we're gonna stick them directly to the walls. Not this side. Yes, this side. Now we're gonna create the stand for the book that we have to put into this place. We just gonna stick it into the middle and we gonna create a tiny book. So let's get started with this brown cover and onto it we're gonna place some of the papers but we're gonna trim it just a little bit and now no it's still too big what about now perfect just a line in between the pages and it's pretty much done so we gonna just place it on the stand it's looking gorgeous and now let's make the mom of Slendrina and guys let me know in the comments what is she's name because I don't know okay. So let's make her dress and let's stick her head onto the dress or maybe the body. We're gonna add some of the hair onto her head and now the face. Okay so we're gonna stick her right here. We're gonna place the arms onto the, her body and onto the wall. This is very strange and very scary. Yeah, like this. Let's add the second arm. Oh yes, 
right here. And we're gonna move her head like in the game or right like that. Okay guys, now we're gonna add the chains. So what about we're gonna just stick them to the arms. Okay, and the second one. Okay guys, now we're gonna remove all those things from the table and we're gonna place it on the back tray. Okay guys, I hope I not forgot anything this time. Let's go with this to the oven. And guys, look what I just discovered. This could be great decoration for walls. Let me know what you think about this and now we're gonna clean the mess a little bit. What's up ladies and gentlemen, I'm back from the baking, so let's continue. Hey you, where you think you're going baby? You talking to me? Okay, so time for, you know, unconnecting this. Oh my cat, go away, I'm trying to unconnecting these little pieces of clay from the baking tray. Your bad hole smelling very not nice, can you go away please? Please, don't move my camera, very not nice cat. I'm trying to, you know, unconnect this from the baking tray. And now guys, ASMR, like always, because this channel is now ASMR. Everything is unconnected, I'm so proud of myself. Now it's time for the... Baking! So let's put this baking tray somewhere, I don't need it anymore. And now, dear watchers, let's take this mat for the painting. Yes, it's vlog channel now. Let's take this. Alright, so for the painting we need paints. This is our paints. Okay, so for the mixing of the colors we need this. And for the wiping my paint we need this. And guys, in the previous video I saw a comment What paint do you use? I use those paints, Vallejo paints. Okay, so we're gonna pour a few drops of it on this painting tray. Let's take this old brush and we're gonna do some magic. Okay, time for dirty guys. You know what? Actually the bigger the brush is, the easier the dirty is. Let's dirt some walls now. Ah, too much of the dirt. Let's dirt the stairs, they deserve to be very dirty. And the wall for the stairs, I mean next to the stairs. And now let's dirt the secret room. Time to dirt the tiny little elements. Okay, everything is dirty, everything is nice. Now it's time for the... Assembly. Okay guys, we don't have much time. Let's glue first the Slendrina's room. I mean, granny room. I mean, mother Slendrina room? Whatever. Let's just glue this poor woman to this wall. I mean, she's already glued to the wall, but we're gonna glue them hair to the base, okay? Okay guys, let's cut this wall just a little bit because Chirik made it too long. That is so hard, guys! Ah. One more thing, one more chance for Zerek, Lord Zerek. Mm -hmm. ah. Why this is so hard? Oh my god, this is so... no! Ah. Okay, whatever, let's just glue it. Right here. And let's just connect those two walls for extra protection and security. <laughs> And guys, the last one, the last wall of this uh, room. Uh, are you happy about this? Let me know in the comments. Okay, guys, the mother of granny is made. All right, now we're gonna glue it to the ground floor. No, to the first floor. This is the first floor, yes. Just behind the bookshelf, like in the game. Wow, <laughs> wonderful. Okay, guys, so let's glue the first wall to the base of granny spider room. Now let's glue the second wall and let's glue those two for you know best 
or what. And now this little thing over here, and we're gonna cut it because this is a little bit too long. Now we're gonna place the house for the spider and we're gonna assemble the tiny little tail and we're gonna place it somewhere over here. What about we're gonna place the gun somewhere over here and the shelf right maybe here and now it's time for the first barrel so we're gonna place it here. Now it's time for the meat. So what about meat? We're gonna do it right here. Alright, let's put some more barrels. And the last one we're gonna put above those two. Okay guys, time to close it. And the last wall, let's place it. Guys, do you remember when I was doing the attic, this? Now it's time to finish it a little bit. We're gonna stick this element over here and we're gonna close it by just adding this element over here okay we're gonna do the same from this side because we want it to be connected from all the sides guys this video is brought to you by skillshare skillshare is an online learning community for creators it have more than 25,000 classes in various categories like for example crafts graphic design film productions and many many more with it you can basically learn anything from the scratch that interests you and as you see each class contains several videos that guide you precisely to the whole process so this is a really nice way of learning i'm really eager to learn this digital illustrating in procreate because i want to create my own designs for my merch so if you are a youtuber filmmaker or maybe crafter and you would like to improve your skills or maybe you just want to start and learn something new skillshare is a great place for this and skillshare and me have a surprise for you first 500 subscribers who use the link in the description will get two months free trial and with that you can watch any class for two months and after that if you decide to stay annual subscription is less than 10 dollars a month so it's super affordable comparing to other ways of getting knowledge the link is skl.sh slash or it is just in the description. Be the one who gets two months free and happy learning. And now guys, we're gonna see the final result. As you see, this is all connected. Let's see how it looks like from above. Make sure to watch the previous videos from this series and see you next Wednesday. There will be a 1 million special video and after that we're gonna create the granny garden.